Okie dokie. In this video, we are taking a look at installing Google Chrome in Ubuntu for Windows Subsystem for Linux. This is specifically for WSLG, which I believe is the Windows Subsystem for Linux graphical instance. If you're using WSL2 and want to get GUIs working with WSL2, then you can take a look at this post here. I'll link this in the description. But for now, let's just focus on this. So we're going to go through typical things you do with a Linux distro. So I'm just going to hop on over to my terminal and update all my dependencies, add my super secret password, and wait for that to update. Now that's updated, I can go and download the latest version of Google Chrome. I paste it in here. And now that's downloaded, I can install it. And I paste that in here. So the dash Y here, this is just to okay the upcoming prompt. So if I just remove this Y and just say sudo apt install, I'm prompted to say yes to install all these packages. I'm just going to do control C here and paste in that command again, dash Y, and this will just accept all of those prompts. And it looks like it's failed to fetch here for some reason. So I'm just going to do the developer favorite and just run the command again and hope for a different outcome. And this time you can see we've got a, a progress bar here. Okay, so it looks like it's installed. Let's try Google Chrome now. Um, and let's try version. We get the version. So I should be able to run this now. So if I just say Google Chrome here and hit enter. I get my pop-up for Google Chrome here asking me to make its default browser and asking me to send analytics to them. I'm just going to uncheck both of them and hit OK. And then over on the other window here, I have a Google Chrome open up, which I can use. So I can close this, and I can also select it from my applications now in Windows. And here it is. Okay, so that's it for this one. I hope you found it useful, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.